Hey guys, um, my name is Heather Childress and welcome to my week four informative speech. Tonight I will be talking to y'all about nutrition. Nutrition is extremely important for everybody. It doesn't matter how old you are, you can be an infant, like a toddler, a child, a teen, adult, like elderly, like you, it doesn't matter, like it's so important. And a lot of people don't know a lot about it, so that's why people struggle with maybe being overweight or obese. And it's crazy because in America we have the highest obesity rate. And I had looked something up and it said that an estimated 160 million Americans are either obese or overweight. And I feel like that is because of the lack of knowledge about nutrition. So I will be speaking about nutrition because I am an exercise science major, so I have had my fair share of nutrition classes that I have taken. So I kind of know a little bit about it, and I hope that y'all gain something from this. Okay, nutrition, why is it important? Well, most people know good nutrition and physical activity can maintain a healthy weight. But the benefits of good nutrition go way beyond weight like way beyond like there's so many benefits to it so the first one that i'll be talking about is it reduces the risk of some diseases including heart disease osteoporosis diabetes stroke and even some cancers and it can also reduce high blood pressure high blood pressure excuse me lower high cholesterol it can improve your well-being it can improve your ability to fight off illnesses improve your ability to recover from illnesses and injuries if you so happen to have any and it also increases your energy level so going off of it increases your energy level if you have good nutrition in your body like good nutrients if you eat healthy and also work out on a daily basis or like every other day whatever feels comfortable for you it can relieve so much stress and it just makes you like feel like you have like nothing on you like you have no stress like nothing like you're just so full of life and it's just like it's so nice and going off about the fight illnesses and stuff like if you have if you take in like a lot of bad foods or if you don't exercise regularly like that can bring in some bad things into your body and it's kind of harder to get better if you are sick it takes a little bit longer for your body to fight it off but if you maintain a healthy weight with eating right and exercising it can help fight them off way faster if you have a healthy immune system and healthy body it just it makes it so much easier to fight off anything that comes into your body and is trying to take over it in a negative way and so what is good nutrition? Good nutrition means that your body gets like basically all the nutrients, vitamins, and minerals that it needs to work its best. And you need to plan your meals and snacks to include nutrient-dense foods. I can't stress that enough. Like, yes, it's okay to maybe have like a cheeseburger every once in a while, but if you have that as your diet for like five out of seven days a week, it's like it's not going to help anything. And trust me, it's hard for me to say that because I love eating cheeseburgers, but I had to learn that the hard way that it is just not good to eat that a lot. And you have to eat, like, you have to watch the calories that you eat also. But if you go out and food shop, you don't want to focus on just the calories. You also want to focus on maybe, like, how much protein it has, how, like, little of sugar it has. Like, that's also very like good to look at and also the carb rate carbs are good like there's a lot of myths going around that oh like carbs aren't good for you i'm going to go on a no carb diet like that's not okay like carbs are actually very good to take in and as long as you have like a good amount taking in then you're fine and so here's some tips for eating well you can eat plenty of fruit fruit is very high in nutrients it's very good for you you don't want to eat too much because sometimes it can upset your stomach if you take in too much but if you eat like a good right amount it's totally fine and make sure you eat plenty of vegetables also those are packed with vitamins and minerals that make your 
organs and everything work better and efficient. And you want to eat some whole grains. At least maybe half of the cereals and breads and crackers and stuff that you eat, you want to just minimize that, but you still want to have some. And you want to choose maybe like low-free or fat-free milk because if you get like maybe like whole milk or something, it's it sits on your stomach bad and it just like it's hard to digest and it just like makes you feel bloated and it makes you just feel like you're so heavy and like it just does not feel good. And you want to make sure you choose lean meats as well. And lean cuts of meat and poultry have less fat and fewer calories, but are still also good sources of protein. Me, I am very big on we should still eat meat. Like we shouldn't just like not cut it out because meat has like a lot of healthy stuff that is good for us and makes us stronger. So I am a big fan of that. And maybe you want to try and if you don't want to eat meat, like a lot of red meat, you can add some like fish or like some beans or some tofu. I'm a fan of all of those. They are very healthy for you. And basically what I'm trying to get at is you just want to try and take care of your body. Like it's okay to have cheat days. It really is. It's really okay. Like it's not going to affect anything, but you can't have that every single day. You just want to make sure that you are watching what you eat and what you take in and you just want to make sure you exercise regularly. Even if you don't like running, go out outside and maybe like take a walk. Like taking walks, trust me, I don't like running, <laughs> but taking walks is actually very peaceful for you also and it just makes you feel good in like the long run. And also, like, I would try and maybe, like, meal prep. Meal prepping helps a lot if you are trying to maybe lose weight or, to, like, try and get healthier. It's a very good thing. And it's also, like, fun to do. Like, if it's fun to, like, make food. Like, especially if you know that it's going to benefit you in the long run. So, I hope y'all, like, learned a little bit about nutrition in this video. And I will see y'all next week. Bye!